Good morning, agriculture economists. I wanted to take a moment to welcome you to week number four. Can you believe we're almost 25% of the way through the semester? It's amazing how fast time can fly when you're having fun. Well, this week we have a pretty significant week ahead of us, although we only have two major assignments. The first assignment I've tried to expose you to through the discussion posts. The assignment is entitled Economic Article Analysis Number 1. And your intent is to go ahead and find your own article that has kind of an agricultural flair to it. I would recommend perhaps Bakersfield.com, BakersfieldNow.com, Farms.com. It's another spot to find some great agriculture articles. But you're finding a short article that has some interest to you. And then you're going to go ahead and, without summarizing, apply some economic analysis, similar to what we attempted to do in discussion number three. Now, this is going to be a little bit longer, but still pretty short for an essay, 350 words, or about one page. Now, make sure you take a look and at the references at the end of your paper that you have provided me an active link so I can go ahead and read the article that you are referring to. This is all due on Sunday, right before midnight. And so take a look at the thorough instructions that are linked in the introduction page for week number four. Also this week, we are preparing you for our very first test in this class, exam number one. Now this test is going to be on three areas, California agriculture, chapter one, and chapter two. And I've tried to provide some quality links to the chapter one and chapter two resources, including some videos that I put together on the PowerPoints. But as you take a look at the California agriculture information, it's predominantly going to be from the PDFs that I provided you, the statistical information. And as you look through that kind of information, let me remind you, I am not looking for insignificant detail. We can figure out how much cauliflower is grown in Monterey County, but I really don't care. I'm not sure if that is significant in our world. However, I think it's pretty important to know who are the countries that we export to. What are those top three, four, five countries? What are the big exports that we send out? What is the most productive or the most valuable commodity in California and in Kern County? I think those bigger picture ideas are what I'm looking for on the test for you to make sure that you have shoved in your brain somewhere. Now, the test will open up on Friday and it will close on Sunday. So you have three days to take the test. Please keep an eye out on the times that it opens and the times that it closes. The test is 50 questions, all multiple choice and true false. And I'll have the test reopen on Monday if you want to come back in there and review the answers that you have provided. So it have all the right answers on Monday after you've taken the test. As always, if you have any questions, reach out to me through the Ask the Professor forum and have a fantastic week.